feel good. I feel great. You guys know why I feel great? I bet you don't know. I know you don't know. See, I feel good because I don't have to lie to any of you anymore and pretend to like your ugly faces. I came out here as sick as it made me, pretended to like you, made some money off you, went to the back, put it in the car, and now it's time to go home. So... You people were lucky to see me be in the presence of me. I'm going on to bigger and better things. Before we leave, my sexy vixen, do you have anything to say? Yeah, I got a few things to say. Give the Charleston Chunkies a piece of your mind. You know, I actually fell asleep on the way up here, not knowing I was coming to West Virginia. Too much wine in the limo. <laughs> and I felt a jarring in the limo, and I was like, what's that? I woke up to the smell of garbage and looked up and welcome to West Virginia, son. <laughs> Don't be mad at me because I didn't make this state that way. If you're gonna be mad at somebody, you can be mad at heredity, be mad at God, you know, because they're the ones that made it all happen. It wasn't me. I'm too good. <laughs> Now you're coming out here. Where are you going? I'm going, I'm going home. No, 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 no. Get back up here. You're coming out here telling these people how great you are, but you're about to go one on one with simply the best, and we'll find out just how tough enough you are. That's all I got. Just for the record, you've got about 200 people in downtown Charleston West, by God, Virginia, calling you a chicken. If you're keeping still chicken, does that matter? I'll chant, I'll chant Kentucky Fried Chicken for You know, but chicken is actually better than the alternative, which... What was, what was that name you had on that show? What? what uh, skid marks! Skid marks! I'll tell you what, skin marks, you and me right now, right here in Charleston, West Virginia.